Decepticon. What up, boy? Yo, dog. What's going on, Pooch? I understand you're here to tease us, bro. Yo, let me tell you something, Decepticon. You know what I mean? It's just one of these things where, especially being a, a, a somewhat of a native of Atlanta, like filming out there for like four or five years, like it's really cool to be uh, a part of this interview, man. We got the game series finale August fifth on BET this Wednesday, 10 p.m. Y'all bet not miss it, cause I'm out. If y'all do, I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come see some people. <laughs> Pooch, man, you're right on, man. We will be tuning in to see the game. Can you believe it, man? Nine full seasons, and man, that puts it right up there with the classics. No, no, absolutely. And and I think before we even kind of talk about the nine seasons, we also have to look at the fan support and the and the fans playing a huge part of that con because, like, without them, we wouldn't be here. And to have nine seasons, first show, a black show, is uh, is exciting and impressive. So we definitely have to give a, a huge shout out to the fans, and uh, I'm thankful uh, to be a part of this run. I mean, I I only did the five seasons plus the the episode where I got traded, but to come back as Derwin, I think was needed to say farewell to the character, and uh, and I'm so thankful for the fans for allowing me to come back and wanting me back. So thanks, guys. Yo, dog, Pooch, man, you're right on point. We will be tuning in. I'm so glad you're back with the show. The game, I got to tell you, your fans love you on there. The season finale, as you mentioned, just coming right up in a few days. But uh, I got to ask, you're playing a character and a half. Tell us what it's like playing Derwin. It was cool, man, to, because, like, for a while, I, w I had my boxing gloves on. For the, for the last three years, I had my boxing gloves on over at Ray Donovan on Showtime, which that's the show that I'm on now, which we come on Sunday nights at 9 p.m. Um, to kind of put the gloves, take the gloves off, and then strap my cleats on, and then to go back over there and put the jersey back on and, and kind of, you know, play Derwin was really, really fun. But it wasn't a stretch because I've been Derwin for so long that it wasn't hard to get back into it. And then having Tia there as girl Melanie, you know, we just brought that magic back, man. And I think a lot of people are going to be excited with what uh, her and I do given what the, the <laughs> what the series finale is going to be about. But it doesn't have to end there, Khan. I mean, why not? Why do we have to stop at nine? Why not a movie? Why can't we do a movie? How come, how, how come not a season 10? And I think that given what happens after people see the finale, I think we should talk about those things. I mean, Entourage got a movie. Sex and the City got a movie. Like, why not us? Like, why does it have to end at nine? <laughs> we need more Derwin, man. I do hope the show gets picked up, whether it's in the movie theaters or maybe another season. But uh, congratulations on this great run. Let me ask you, what was it about acting? Who initially gave you the support that you needed to be where you are today? Um, I think I have to give a huge shout out to my, my dad and my late mom, you know, Cynthia Hall, of, like supporting me and being behind me as a, um, a young black man in this world to where it's like, there's nothing you can't do. You just gotta believe in yourself. And like, I, you hear it all the time from like on social media. Social media is, is a monster sometimes because you can post something on social media and then you have a lot of negativity that kind of follows that with, I don't like your suit, you got fat, like you disappeared, like I don't like your acting. And it's kind of like to each his own. But I think you have to find that harmony within yourself and that belief in, you know, yourself to find the love that makes you strong from your family to the ones who really do love you and focus on that. But I've been through a lot to where, you know, I, I'm not going to allow it to break me to where I'm going to continue moving on because I do see myself up there with Will and Denzel and the Robert Downey Juniors and the DiCaprios and, um, you know, just to name a few. So, like, I'm ready, you know what I mean? I'm already sh proving myself on Ray Donovan. We're in our third season, and we're killing right now. So, um, from the game to Ray Donovan, like, Pooch Hall is ready for whatever else is thrown at me. Well, we're excited with each character you bring to life, whether it's on Showtime, BET, man, you got a bright future. We get to enjoy it. Congratulations on the big season finale coming up this week on The Game, man. You rock, bro. Decepticon, you be well, brother.